Sacagawea, otherwise pronounced as Sacagawea, was a Shoshone Native American girl who was most known for helping Lewis and Clark in their expedition of the western United States. Sacagawea was then kidnapped in 1800 at the age of 13 by the Hadassah tribe. She was purchased by a French-Canadian fur trader named Tao Saint Charbonneau, and she was then married to him at the age of 16. In the winter of 1804 and 05, Lewis and Clark and the Corps of Discovery arrived. They needed a translator to translate the Hidatsa language to help them with trading, and Charbonneau told them that Sacagawea spoke Shoshone. Sacagawea was very helpful to the Corps of Discovery with horse trading, translation, local navigation, peace with other tribes, and finding food. She traveled thousands of miles from North Dakota to the Pacific Ocean between 1804 and 1806. Lewis and Clark hired Charbonneau as guide and interpreter in large part to secure the services of Sacagawea. Sacagawea spoke Hidatsa and Shoshone, but more importantly, she was Shoshone. Lewis and Clark knew they would need to get horses from that tribe. Barely 20 and traveling with her newborn son, Sacagawea would prove invaluable to Lewis and Clark. She had been um, stolen from her tribe and brought to the east, to the Missouri, from the Rocky Mountains. And so she knew not only some of the landmarks and the route, but she knew about the land and how to survive on it. She's very important in a symbolic sense as a type of emblem of peace. Her presence as a woman with a, a babe in arms basically signaled the peaceful intentions of the Lewis and Clark expedition. Lewis and Clark said that without the help of Sacagawea and the Indians, they would have starved to death or got lost in the Rocky Mountains. She was a huge contribution to their journey. The National American Woman Suffrage Association of the early 20th century named her as a symbol of woman's worth and independence, making several statues and plaques in her memory. Streams, lakes, landmarks, parks, and songs honor her today also. Sacagawea's face is printed on the $1 coin admiring her for her accomplishments. So what? How did Sacagawea contribute to our society today? Sacagawea was not the most important member of the Corps, but her presence was valuable to Lewis and Clark, the Corps, and therefore America. Today Americans are searching for heroes, especially women who they can hold up as role models. She was a great interpreter and a friendly woman. Without the help of Sacagawea, it is said that the expedition would have been impossible to complete.